every single step about applying a furniture design transfer to your project. I'm gonna use my Whimsical Wonderland Furniture Design Transfer. This is what it looks like divided into four sheets, but I wanna use it this direction. When you pull the transfer out of the tube, you'll have the transfer itself. You'll also have an application stick. Some other things that you may wanna have, a pair of scissors, a acto knife of some sort. When you pull the transfer out of the tube, you will unroll and it comes in four sheets. Now the transfer is too tall for these two pieces, and so I'm actually gonna trim it down. I don't want any of this white Excess around the bottom. So as I moved this down exactly where I wanted it, just ran my fingernail across that bottom edge all the way across, and it leaves this line across the bottom. I'm just gonna cut it with scissors. Nice and simple. They have it cut the way I want it. I'm gonna go ahead and pull my backing off. This outside edge that's clear is where you wanna hold on to it. My poppy is in the lower left corner. Now I'm gonna just stick this in place. I want to press this into place so that I can run my blade through there. I'm gonna press it above it and below it, and I'm just gonna run this along that edge. Same thing with this next edge. So that's that, all of that is in place, and now I'm just gonna start rubbing with my stick. Rub from one section, just keep making your way over. Okay, so in order to get started, I usually take a piece of my backing, cut a little piece off of it, hide it underneath there, and lift it. I'm gonna do what's called a push and pull technique. I'm pushing my stick while I'm pulling the paper back. All of the pressure being right where you're lifting. Rub that piece off and keep going. Is that easy? 